This video will show you how to apply Google Labs in your Gmail account. There are some particular little fun things you can download from your Google settings. To do that, you can go to the gear in the top right hand corner, drop the drop down arrow, go to settings, and this time instead of staying in the general tab area, we're going to come over here to the labs. I'm not going to go through every lab on the list, but I'm going to show you a couple of my favorites. One is this Google Calendar gadget I've enabled. You can see right down here in the bottom left hand corner. When I'm in my Gmail, I can just see today's events, important things going on. Um, I have a Meet the Teacher event at Barrington Elementary School for my son tonight. So I can keep that in the back of my mind that, oh, I have to do this, or the rest of my day's events have already gone past, but if I have a meeting at 11, I can just keep my eye on it throughout the day. Another Google Lab is a preview. Um, anytime you put an attachment in an email, it will show you a little um, icon and a little preview of what is actually in that document. So you can see if you've attached the right thing or you have the right, um, or you can see what other people are sending to you. This is a big one, the undo send. In first class, we have always had the ability to go ahead and click that unsend function that was at the top. We no longer have that ability. In Gmail, you can select this lab. You can then go into the settings and it will either give you five seconds, 10 seconds, or 20 seconds. And a little yellow message will be at the top of your screen after you've sent it and it will simply say what you see here, undo. A lot of times right after we've sent an email we realize we, that we misspoke or put the wrong date or forgot to add somebody to the list. So in that case you would be able to click on undo send and the email would go back into your inbox. So that's a great function. I like this one, the unread message icon. If I'm working in Google Drive or in something else like my videos for Google, um, I can just keep my eye on this area and as you can see, mine's at zero right now, but in the example it says eight. This means that person has eight messages waiting for them in their inbox. Um, the rest of them I'm just gonna have you take a peek through. I'm gonna warn you about this multiple inboxes. It's having some issues and um, kind of messed up my whole screen so I ended up I ended up disabling this function. These settings are called labs in Google. This is the Google employees are allowed 20% of their day to be creative. It's almost like a competition to them who can create um, these li neat little add-ons. Um, after a while, if they're not successful and not enough people enable them, they actually disappear off this list. So if you happen to do this preview option or the Google Calendar gadget, and then six months down the line, a, a coworker says, hey, where'd you get that? That's really neat how you have that down there. And you go here to find it. It may not be here. If they do become successful, they will be in um, the gadgets and labs, uh, the Google Chrome store where you can add them permanently. But these are just experimental. They're all in beta. They're all in testing. So just keep that in mind as you add labs to your account. I hope you found some fun labs and share this message with a friend. Thanks.